then I will show you over 10 amazing extensions for your browser. So without wasting any time, let's get right into it. Ads are some of the worst things about browsing the internet and this is where uBlock Origin comes into play. uBlock Origin is a content blocker that blocks ads and any type of suspicious or data stealing requests from being made. It works by having a predefined list of ads slash malicious URLs that is constantly being updated and if uBlock sees that a website is trying to request one of those URLs, it's going to block it immediately, eliminating ads and other suspicious content for bloating. So this extension not only makes web browsing better but also protects your privacy and security at the same time. It's also free and open source, trusted by the privacy community and works with both Chrome and Chromium based browsers as well as Firefox and Firefox based browser. Links in the description down below. These days there are a lot of extensions out there that allows you to block certain websites from bloating so that you can actually focus and get things done. Although these are great and helpful extensions for some people including me, blocking you YouTube entirely isn't convenient as there are some videos that are actually really useful and only available on YouTube. That's where Unhook comes into play. You can think of Unhook as a YouTube customizer. It allows you to customize YouTube so that it only shows the things you need. For example, you can hide the YouTube homepage and only show the search bar so that you don't get distracted. Not only that, you can remove YouTube suggestions entirely or remove just YouTube short and the list just goes on and on, allowing you to customize YouTube to the fullest extent and allowing you to actually Actually get things done while using YouTube as a great platform for learning and or researching. Ever since YouTube removed dislike counters, it's been a real pain in the butt to decide if a video is watch worthy or not. But don't worry as there's an extension called Return YouTube Dislike. And as the name suggests, it's a simple extension that restores the dislike count on YouTube videos. If you want to know more about how it works, you can check the official website. The final extension to fix YouTube is called Sponsor Block. And also, as the name suggests, it also he skips sponsor segments in YouTube video. One thing note is that because the way that it works, depending on the video that you're watching and also video settings, when the creator uploaded it, sponsor block can either detect a sponsor segment and skip it or can't detect it at all. However, from my experience, eight times out of 10, it works like magic, detecting sponsor segments and skipping them automatically. Now let's talk about extensions that improve your privacy online, starting with clear URL. What it does is special. It removes any tracking elements from URLs. Let me give you guys an example. This right here is an Amazon URL with tracking elements in it, which is why it's very long. If I open it in a browser that does not have this extension enabled, it's going to go to that Amazon page with all the tracking enabled. However, with clear URLs, it's going to detect that they are tracking elements and going to remove them immediately and also shortening the URL at the same time. Just like uBlock Origin, it's completely free and open source and available with all major web browsers. Moving on to the next extension, which is called Decentralize which protects you from free, centralized content delivery. The simplest way to describe what it does is that Decentralize strips sensitive data from the outgoing request. Obviously, I am not an expert in this privacy and security category, and that's the best explanation I got. However, Decentralize is still an amazing free and open source browser extension that makes your online browsing even safer. The final extension that I want to talk about in this category is Privacy Badger. Just like other extensions in this category, it's a free and open source extension that is trusted by the community and is available on major web browsers. What Privacy Badger does is to stop advertisers and other third-party trackers from secretly tracking where you go and what pages you look on the web. If an advertiser seems to be tracking you across multiple websites without your permission, Privacy Badger automatically blocks that advertiser from loading any more content in your browser. And to the advertiser, it looks like you suddenly disappeared. Moving on to making web browsing better and safer, starting with Don't F with Pace. It is a really useful extension to have that bypasses the restrictions that prohibits the user from copying something and pasting into a text field. This is something that always infuriates. I have a long password for security reasons and I don't want to type it in manually. However, with Don't Effort Paste, it detects in the website source that there is a restriction and remove that immediately. And don't worry, this doesn't mess with the website or its backend at all. And all it does is to simply remove the restriction on the front of, of the website. Next is skip redirect. Listen, we have all been there. We were trying to download something, but in order to actually download the file we want, we had to go through multiple websites. This is extremely annoying and a waste of time. But with Skip Redirect, it automatically bypasses the process of manually going through multiple websites and does all of that automatically for us in the background. So we don't have to waste any time waiting for different websites to load. Since 2021, it became mandatory that websites ask for users' permission for storing cookies. 
because of the European Union. While it is a good thing, it is very annoying. And with this extension, it automatically skips that for you by just blocking or hiding the cookie pop-up. Of course, if the pop-ups are required to load a website, it's either going to automatically accept it or accept only the ones that are necessary. The final extension that I want to talk about is Syrup. And you can think of it as a legitimate alternative to Honey that actually looks for coupons and doesn't steal money from creators. It's currently in its beta stage, but the extension works really, really well. This is a bonus part of the video and I have a few more extensions that are great, but I don't personally use. However, I believe that these extensions are going to be extremely useful for you guys. The first one is the Camelizer that shows you the price history of Amazon products so that you can actually see if it's a great deal or not. The second one is Save to PNG that allows you to save images in PNG or JPEG. This is extremely useful as most search engines like Google use WebP for images on the web while it allows great quality images for an extremely small size. Since it's not compatible with most apps including Adobe Premiere Pro for example, it's extremely annoying to manually convert them and this extension solves all of those problems and headaches. I want to speak want these last extensions and they are screenshot YouTube that allows you to screenshot YouTube videos and default accounts for Google services that allows you to pair a specific Google account for a specific Google service. That's all that I've got for this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more tech videos like this. Until then, take care.